Okay guys, Archon Snime here bringing you guys another YouTube video, giving my thoughts on the Sephiroth trailer for Smash Brothers Ultimate. I have not seen this yet, I kind of want to give a reaction to it. I do want to apologize for the last video that went up on the channel. Uh, it was a World of Warcraft tour gas video. I'll have to figure out a way to make that work going forward. Uh, just wanted to apologize for that. I will try to do another upload and I will try to get that figured out. Anyway, let's go ahead and take a look at the Sephiroth video here and see what we have. So we know it's Sephiroth. And this was that announced at the VGAs. Everybody's getting beaten down. So oh, there's the boss from story mode. I, I want to see Sephiroth just slice it right in half. Yep, there it is. Right in half. There it is. Absolutely amazing. A throwback to his advent children. I kind of wonder what his wind pose is going to be. Oh, that's pretty cool. As his parry. Wait a second. Hold on. Did he just cut the stage in half? Oh, wait, is he getting his own st Hold on, what is that? That's another Advent Children reference, I believe. So I think he's getting his own stage. Got Shadow Flare. Yep, there's his stage. That's... That's not cool, Nintendo. That's a throwback to the end of Final Fantasy VII Discord. Was that the high... Hold on, was that the high wind? Dude, there's so much, like, Easter egg stuff in this trailer, it's hard to keep track of it all. Because that was Gen the Genova map. This is the High Wind. Why is the High Wind there? There's your reference. Just back pedals. He has a back. Or, wow. He actually has a back step. Or a back dash. There's Meteor. Oh. Oh wow, that- holy crap, that's gruesome. Oh, he hooked him by the shirt. I was gonna say, there's no way Nintendo was gonna allow that. And this is what we all came for. Cloud vs. Sephiroth and Smash Bros. They, like, directly took it from Advent Children. Wait, is he- This is amazing. It's just a direct, like, scene for scene from. Oh, save for Sephiroth. I can't remember what the translation is for that. That's insane, though. So his final smash is probably going to be Supernova. I cannot wait to be able to try this out. Holy crap. Yeah, that's Supernova in the background. It'd be crazy if they gave us the super long animation version for Supernova. Go back and take a look. There were so many Advent Children references throughout. We didn't get to see a wind pose either. Version of the game report, obviously. That is nice though, you can stab like the stage and use it as a jump.
so that'll be his stage. I'm curious what the high wind is, like why the high wind's there. I'm having trouble looking at my mouse. Like, what, what is that about? That's crazy as a backdash too. So did he not have... Hold on. We'll come back. 154. We'll come back to that in a second. I want to see... First look at him in the... So he didn't have his wing out. So he doesn't have the wing here. I wonder if it's like a tr uh, formation change. Or just a transformation. Kind of like Joker does for his persona. Where you'll be able to like down B or something and pull out the wing. And then it changes your, your skill set all around. So I wonder if at the VGAs there was more news about Final Fantasy VII Remake then. I can't believe they, they, they let him do that. It looks so bad, it almost looks like he stabbed Mario through. And then a direct rip from Advent Children. So many easter eggs. Claude did enough damage to finally give Sephiroth his oh, ultimate. Oh, 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 oh. Instead of turning into Kadaj, you just get the favor Sephiroth. Yeah, I, I cannot wait to get my hands on Sephiroth. Uh, I don't technically own the game, but I do have a friend that does, and I'm going to definitely go visit him and give Sephiroth a try when he comes out. What do you guys think of the announcement for Sephiroth in Smash Brothers? Are you excited for it? Are you excited to do the Cloud vs. Sephiroth matchup? Uh, I'm hoping Sephi has a lot of uh, weapons, and or not weapons, but a lot of tools that make him a good character, because there are a lot of sword fighters in Smash already. I'm hoping he doesn't feel just like a generic one and they actually make him unique because Sephiroth is mostly known for his high speed offense. And it did look like they had a lot of that going with his rapid slashes. I think they probably had like an Octa Slash in there. He also had access to Shadow Flare. Uh, I really want to see his uh, final smash. I have a feeling it's Supernova, but I'm curious what version of Supernova we're going to get. If it's going to be just a little five second thing where it's like it's already hitting Earth and it, you know, knocks everybody everywhere. Or if it's going to be the full... That, it would be just insane if they gave him the full animation for Supernova where it completely destroys the Milky Way galaxy on its way to Earth. But I'm excited for it. Are you guys excited for Smash or for Sephiroth and Smash? Let me know down below. Who's the next fighter you guys are also looking forward to? And are there any other surprise fighters that you think will be added? Because I did not have Sephiroth on my list. I will tell you that. So with that, guys, I'm going to go ahead and head out of here. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Again, sorry for the last video. I'm going to work on that. I'm going to try to get World of Warcraft guides going. It's just I'm having trouble with the uh, encoder on OBS. Apologize again. Like, or like the video if you guys enjoyed it. And I will see you guys on the next video. Catch you guys later. Peace.